Welcome your faces to FMTN Champions League Tournament Where we where we spun where a random wheel was spun we got assigned different teams and The wheel gave us Chelsea So for the remainder of this competition no matter how long we get to I will be Chelsea We will be Chelsea players only It'll be a draft thing because at the moment of recording this versus is not out yet so therefore we can't automatically take Chelsea, so we have to draft the Chelsea players. And whatnot, whatnot. We are. Most people who watch this anyway are probably familiar with Chelsea's team, so we won't get too much into that. But yes, that is the situation here. In this video here, we will have the group stages to see if we get out. And this series will have one, two, three, potentially four parts. We don't know yet. But I'm hoping to get to the final. If I do though, this there will be four pots of this. But keep keep an eye, at least there's one pot. Hopefully there's two. You'll find out. In the real Champions League, like always, we have Juventus, Malmo, and Zenit in this group. Like real life. You know what it is. And the other groups are going on as well. One of my friends, Bragster, is in one of the groups. He's just Bayern Munich. So who knows, that might be a potential thing to happen if the draws are kind at some point. Or unkind, depending on how you look at it, it's buying. But yes, we are Chelsea. That is what we do. I have a soundboard of Chelsea stuff, just in case. And we will see how this evolves. But without further ado... Oh yeah, I forgot to say, the winner of this whole... If we do get to the final win it, the winner get to place automatically in the actual FMTM competition in its season two. It had season one, I did apply, didn't get in. So, but in this one we got in the Champions League, so we have a place to, we have a chance to automatically, but I have to do the hard work getting there to get into that. So we will have to see what happens. So without further ado, Roll that intro. I feel nauseous, believe me. Never had a lot of shit come easy. Had to work hard, struggle just to be me. Had to rise up just so they could see me. Is of course against the toughest one, Juventus. We were at home first, then we have three away games on the spin, and then we end it with two home matches. That, the three away games on the spin is the interesting dynamic. Away fixtures are not always the greatest of luck bases that you have on FM. It's an interesting pass, Chilwell. Got Jorginho here to pull the schist of her. Uh, typical Werner, he's offside. <laughs> No orders. Not typical Werner. Well, that's typical Lukaku there. Missed like a point blank. Gil Dan's chance. Mandy the Chris is in. Chris and the Rudiger were playing quite risky. A good thing Timo. Has a speed. Rom has no Timberland boots. Donkey feet, that man. Donkey feet. Gonna encourage the lads because it looks like we might need it. Whatever this chance goes. Turbo Timo. The Havertz sends Lukaku in. Dinks the kick. Ramalu Lukaku. Probably switching things up. Formation wise. Uh, they got one back and it's not good, not good, not good, not good, not good. I'm going to encourage them because don't let their head drops. We don't want their heads to drop. 
because that could easily happen like they just did there with that stupid pass. Kante, don't take too long in the ball, Jorginho, trying to get it to Pulisic, didn't work out for him. Chilwell now has it now to Jorginho, to Rudiger. Rudiger is passing it up to Azalaqueta, to Kante. Kante and Tao Havertz sends Werner in, and Werner does what Werner does best, not score. Pulisic to whip in across, and Rudiger all gets on it, but it's not powerful enough to do anything. Pulisic to whip it in, and Rama Lukaku. He's yelling at his team, changing his tactics for the second half because he needs to. Werner on the ball. Werner to pass it to Conte. Conte is now going to whip it across. That's very unlike Conte. Don't know what he was doing there. Oh, he's Rabio's in chip stick. That is not what we want, lads. That is not. That is not what we want. Don't drop your heads in the second half, lads. Control the ball. Control the ball, lads. Rom, ah, oh, Rom, you need to be doing better there, mate. Someone get to that. Someone get to that. Why? Why are you letting Dybala run? Thank God you made a tackle. So one person we don't want to let run like that is the uh, is Dybala. Mount pings it over the Havertz. Havertz is in. Havertz. He takes too long, but gets it to Timo. Back to Pulisic. Back to Mount. To Conte, back to Azilaqueta, and the attack continues, but apparently we've been fouled down, I assume. Man's on the free kick. Oh, off the top of the bar. Close, Mount, close. Mount crosses it in. No one gets there. Havertz, no, Havertz, you gotta be getting there, mate. Havertz is about to get yellow carded here. Man pings it to Chilwell. Chilwell loses it, but then wins it back. And then Werner wins it back. Get in, lads. That's unlucky. Turbo Timo gets it to Ziak. Ziak whips it in. Goes to no one. They're out with it. Kylo George, will he score? No, he does not. Almost, though. The ball is clean. On the, you would think this would be the last attack of the game. And Chilwell does a uh, tactical foul. Which leads to nothing for them. Tree back. We won the home game. That's what we needed to do. Now we have the difficult tree back to back away games. Which is always an interesting uh, feat to navigate. We're just waiting for their game to finish. It is currently 3 1 to Malmo of all teams. First versus second in the group. <laughs> Malmo versus Chelsea.
She's called for that. We have a trip to Malmo, which is apparently in Wales. Uh, instantly a corner. Gonna encourage the lads. They have a highlight, which I'm not a fan of. Win the ball back, lads. Why are they in? Win the ball back, lads. Chillwell, that's not what you're supposed to be doing in that situation. Turn on the Jets romp. Pass it in Pulisic. Pulisic got tackled on the edge of the box. Gets it back to Pulisic to Chillwell. Chillwell, what are you going to do, mate? Whips it in. Uh, they're having too many highlights for my liking. That was a close one. That's with the better players. What are you doing? Rom's in. Rom has to put it back. Rom's in. Rom gets it to Havertz. Havertz cross. Havertz, you need to be doing better with that. Sitting off a bit too much for my liking. The whole point was pressing. We're not pressing enough, lads. Mendy, what are you doing? Just pass it out. We need to be quicker here, lads. Quicker. Distribute quicker. Ah, he got blocked. Lads, what is that? You're getting outshone here by Malmo. This is not... We're getting shown up here by Malmo. Yes, lads! That's what I want. Thank God, Jorginho. Finally, a good piece of play, lads. Hopefully, that opens the floodgates for you. What kind of pass is that? You know Timo's not getting there. Mate. Christensen gets it. Passes to Rudiger. Rudiger to Christensen. Christensen to Rudiger. To Pulisic. Pulisic, I mean, then I don't know who that was, but Pulisic has it now. To Jorginho, to Rudiger, to Chilwell, to Jorginho, to Havertz, the Conte, who tries to shoot from there. I don't know why he was, he was trying that. Tries to whip it in. His formation is injured. He's doing a strikerless formation. That is weird to me. But it seems to be working for the most part for him. Because he is getting chances, which I'm not a fan of. I don't like this. But Rom is free. Rom plays in Timo. Timo can't do anything. He was offside anyway. Classic Timo. Classic Timo. Turning on Ziak, Havertz hasn't done enough. Finally, get in. This that forward line that he has just completely terrifies me. This is the whole setup of that forward line. It just, I'm so used, I'm a traditionalist formation person, so that forward line 
just is so confusing, it terrifies me. And I'm not a fan of it. Chilwell running into space. Will he whip it across? He does. The Teemo. Teemo can't get it on target though. Oh dear god, he's in. Say it ain't so. Good tackle, man. Good tackle. Dieck, you you run or pass. Run or pass, mate. Run or pass. You're gonna run? Good job. Now just keep it over here. You're gonna whip it in. Oop. Nomo ain't easy, I can tell you that much. It ain't easy in the Malmo camp. It ain't easy. Now we play Zenit. Saint Petersburg. Let's, let's win us a game of football. We kick off. Jorginho to Pulisic. Pulisic shall run in. Get it to Jorginho. Jorginho tries to cross it out. It doesn't come to anything. That's not good. I will encourage, like I always do at the beginning of these matches, just to instill a bit of belief in them. So we'll cross it in to Timo. Hits it over the bar. Rudiger, oh Rudiger, gotta be doing better there, mate. Aspilicueta to Conte, Conte to Aspilicueta. Aspilicueta will move forward a bit. He will try and whip it all the way to Rom. Rom gets it after Lovren spills it, but cannot do anything with it. He just loses it instantly. Conte with the ball, and it's been paused. Conte does still have the ball. Conte still has the ball. Gets it to Timo. That's going to be disallowed. VAR will check it. Goal has been awarded. Let's go, Timo. Timo whips it in. Finds no one. We're crowding around them, though. <laughs> That's, that's Timo. That's Timo. Misses an open net. That's Timo. That's gonna be it for full time, it's just gonna end 1 0. If he wins, he's on the same points as me. If I win, I'm at least true. I don't know how that's gone in, but it has, but Timo Werner, Timo's on fire. Your defense is terrified. Timo's on fire. Your defense is terrified. That is not what I want you guys to do, but thankfully Rudiger read it. Rom's in, Rom. Get in, Rom. I'll praise Rom for that. That was a good run, Rom. So the game crashed, leaving me seeing this.
The rest of the match without me went a little something like this. Ziak runs in, Ziak crosses it. The team out, but Lukaku's there and he hits it in. Oh, Ramalu Lukaku. Oh, Ramalu Lukaku. Get in, Rom. You'll love to see it. Timo's in, he passes Ziak, gets it to Rom, Rom tries, it's spectacular. Havertz is in. You have a VAR review. VAR review. and it is the runner-up of Group E in Calv FM, Real Madrid, and who have we got? It's Real Madrid versus Chelsea. Boom, boom. Real Madrid. Let's be having you then. That's right, folks. Tour El España begins in the next episode.